This is going to be a real quick video on how to bring your Superstar SUP files directly into S5 Sequence. So the first thing I want to do is I'm going to bring in uh, my sequence for my vertical or my matrix, which I have it set up as a vertical stack is the way it's set up in my preview. So the first thing I'm going to do is left click into the first column and then hit shift end and that's going to put the whole column available to me and I want to make sure I slide the slider all the way back to the beginning and go to the very first block hit the right mouse button and then pick insert superstar effect and that's going to bring up superstar okay let me close this down a little bit so you can see Okay, so when I bring in Superstar, it brings up Superstar for me. This is what my matrix looks like in Superstar. So I'm just going to go ahead and I've already got it preloaded. I've done it a couple times. So I'm just going to bring in the sequence for Secret Agent Man. And you can see it's all there. And if I play a little bit of it, you'll see that it plays fine in Superstar the way it should. Okay, so now I've got it there, and I just close out a superstar. You'll see it writing the commands, and then you'll see the whole line get filled in. There it is. That's it. Bada bing, bada boom. So when I play it, there it is on my matrix in my preview. No copy, no paste, no time. Just It just works. <laughs> That's so cool. This is a game changer for me. It makes the file size a whole lot smaller, too.